the comparison between threats from nation state actors versus cyber criminals um, and how those should be prioritized. So the nation state actors get a lot of the news uh, for good reason. There's incredibly powerful, dangerous uh, capabilities that go along with nation states uh, that can be very harmful to large enterprises. To be honest, in most cases though, what I've seen is organizations that are over-prioritizing nation state threats um, at the risk of not having enough time or resources to combat threats from the cyber criminal underground, which tend to be some of the bigger concerns we have. In most cases, uh, what, we, what we see are criminals that are focused on money, right? That's what criminals care about. So being able to go after our organizations, understand how we process money, how we move money, um, maybe taking advantage of our opportunities to go after business email compromise to try to steal money from us to defraud us or retail fraud. We see a lot more of that uh, than we do nation state actors that are trying to attack private enterprises. Uh, certainly the largest enterprises, large banking, large defense industries, nation state actors have a serious concern. But for most of the mid small companies and even a lot of the large enterprises, cybercrime really should be our top focus.